Okay, welcome back to the channel, my people. So happy to have you here. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. I hope you saw yesterday's video. People have been asking to see my collection and some of the items that I have in there. So we'll be sprinkling in those little tidbits of information throughout the, the next few videos and, and so on. I really, really, really love that Boulevard car. If you saw the video, you know. All right, we're checking a Tarjay now, dude. Oh, wow. I mean, they are definitely dropping this wave of 143s again. So amazing many Holden two packs dude one two three four five six seven eight Holdens are just not popular here you know we're, we're in the U.S. I know the Aussie boys love these cars and they are good cars I mean they're basically like rebranded Pontiacs um hello ultra hot civic Ooh, it's all crushed card is all veined probably was stashed somewhere because it doesn't look like anything new has gone out yeah, I mean, there's only a few cars here. We'll leave this for somebody right up behind here. Nice little, nice little surprise for you. Hello? Yeah, there you go. I can't see the hook. Um, yeah, okay. Nice little surprise. Ooh, 124 fans. Check it out, dude. Brian and the Toyota Supra. They've issued this before. It's not the first time. I love that the roof is off. We've seen that recently at a different store. The red Porsche, the orange Porsche. Lots of cool Porsches for the 124 fans. They also got one D case, and I did a little look in. It's a lot of leftover stuff, fantasy stuff. I'm noticing that the Mad Mike recolor is being left the first color the white color that's the actual color of the irl car not this gray as far as i know it's white i saw it in a in a reel or a clip yeah, pretty sure that i've checked every single cvs except for one in at least within my local area so we're definitely going to hit that store today we'll check with wall farm because i really need bubble wrap so we can get back on whatnot i have more boxes that should be showing up i think our next show the theme will be premiums like all premiums i really i've got extra premiums to be happy to get out to my people from what i can see not every dollar and a quarter tree plus got the g case shipper we did get to check a couple already even one was a dud bro no regular hunt not even a mainline gas monkey corvette i'm looking around now i don't see nothing so pavement to the feet that's how we roll up to the end of the video i'm gonna show you something really cool um okay we're now checking a cvs and for some reason this tray got squished, bro. Wow, it's so heavy, too. What is going on? Hold on, I need two hands, sorry. Okay, it was like stuck on the on the ledge. I don't know why it's so messed up, BMW. We did find a surf crate, finally. Wait, what's all this stuff? Hey, hey, get out of here. We did find a surf crate. Oh, these cards, what happened? What happened to this tray teed off? Oh gosh, all right, I get these cards out of the way. And if there's a Volkswagen in here, we're absolutely leaving it for someone else. Bone Shaker, Dessert Drift, uh, gosh, I hope they don't need those price tags. 180, nothing, cart, nothing. Um, ooh, that's interesting. Is there a shipper possibly somewhere? Ford Escort RS 200. Another, ooh, double Ford. Weird skate crumb. Okay, nothing in this tray. I'm gonna look for the, for the shipper end cap here, the old CBS. Okay, here it is, dude. I mean, it kind of looks untouched. I guess we'll just start at the top. All right, all right, nothing there. DMC DeLorean. Yeah, no, this might be fairly fresh. Pontiac Firebird, let's make, oh, see, gotta be careful. There was another car hidden back there. All right, so we know, yeah, still an M case shipper, the old surf duty, make sure there's not another hidden car. Oh, oh, okay, we dropped something, but it's just a little Civic Custom. New for 23, the Volvo, Lotus Amira. Highway hauler, right? All right, bunch of bunch of stuff in here, dude. Ducati. We also want to watch out for exclusive color. Ca 
R's. Not seeing any mighty K's as of yet. But there was like a little bit of something missing. It may have just fallen out when the when the thing got pulled out of the box. Ooh, black SRT. Dean. Okay. Not too shabby. Koenigsegg. The Vantage. Mustang. Yeah, see down here there was only two cars unless I yanked something. And don't remember. 07 Mustang. Alright, we got uh, Volvo Gas. I'm not seeing even one mighty K, dude. Tesla Roadster. Amira. Mercedes. Yeah, dude. Maybe someone got lucky or it had nothing. I mean, it's possible. We have seen dud end cap shippers before. Cool, I just came to check the pegs over here to make sure like nothing got pegged up. Uh, that maybe that like fell out of the, the little shipper. Check out this Matchbox 5 pack 71 Skyline 2000 nostalgic car, Japanese nostalgic car. It says right on the side JNC. Wait, that's what JNC means? Dude, this is the first time I ever heard of that. Look at the pink Honda Civic Type R two door. Looks weird, bro. There's something Something strange about that casting. Subaru Impreza, lots of good detail. No tail light detail, interesting. We normally don't see that happening on the old matchboxes. Mazda 2019, Mazda 3, and then a Toyota 4Runner, which, you know, everyone kind of likes 4Runners, I guess. Ooh, so close, another CVS shipper. Possibly a dud, tough to say. Kind of seemed like everything was there. That thing, that thing was, dude, it took a hit, bro. Like that shipper must have been like rolling like a bowling ball on the way to that store. Yeah, we did check this wall fart recently and they had a bunch of Hot Wheels from the CK. So they got that, they got the big dump in and this is the store where the worker told me that one dude bought everything. Oh well. That is hunting. But I do have some good news actually here at this wall fart. Um, hello? Dude, is this the first time we're gonna... Well, this isn't the first time, because when we went with works, we found some of these. But holy boulevards! Finally, dude. A Honda Accord right there. That's so cool. The Porsche 935 right there. And we know that the Nissan Z is like no money at all dude it is so inexpensive it's like three dollars everywhere I've been seeing people posting all over the place so far I see three Accords but I think there's a couple more cars somewhere else it's like another hot wheels miracle here at the wall fart i mean we are pavement to the feet peg hunting and this is what happens um hello toyota celica gt4 porsche 935 oh oh hello hello and porsche 935 those are the blue cars oh oh hello hello that's incredible dude we have been pavement to the feet and those boulevards were escaping us holy cow dudes the scalper life is real i'll be honest i've been watching this one page on facebook and people are posting that they bought like 20 of one car and 30 of one car and then they're getting bad comments and they're they're wondering why come on now sharing is caring i'm gonna i need two hands but i'm gonna sneak the accords like in the into the into the mix here i'm not getting every single accord i'll give you the count though i saw i think six total accords so we'll leave two we'll grab four we'll be good collectors and share the wealth i am so curious was that a bunch of cases was that maybe the boulevard shipper i would love to have another boulevard shipper i had one before but i think i junked it dude when you get so many shippers eventually you just have a bunch of cardboard laying around all right we need some bubble wrap so we can get back on whatnot i am almost out i like these big ones yeah it's only 20 bucks dude i was about to get 175 feet on Amazon for 30 so I think this is a is a bargain That's so awesome dude I'm guessing that our little uh, video yesterday about the boulevards brought us a little bit of luck yeah dude for sure for sure the the boulevard video yesterday gave us some luck dude hopefully somebody enjoys finding the two accords that we left I would love to see their face when they walk up on that we are checking a grocery store real quick they they been getting D cases, C cases. And then we're going back to the compound because I want to show you some cool stuff. I know you guys like seeing the stuff in my collection. We have a lot of new people on the channel. Oh, Camaro SS. 
think that was here. We were at this store, I believe, just a few days ago, Camaro SS. Imagine if the international cases had the same carryover, because a lot of people were finding that Camaro in that C case. Pass and gasser, day five million. All right, it doesn't seem like much is here, but you just never know. You never know what can happen when your pavements are to your feet. Dude, Blockade was so worried about me doing a daytime show because he wasn't gonna make it. I said, don't worry, bro, we'll figure it out. And I didn't even do that daytime show. But yeah, now that we have Bubble Wrap, we'll be back on Whatnot, watch them noties, giveaways, shout out to Whatnot Collectibles, spoke to my rep the other day amazing company i know i'm just killing time i'm just i'm not reading the same names every day over and over all right that's cool that's cool we tried we tried we tried all right back to what is that thing oh yeah so definitely a c case showed up for sure because of all those oh by the way they did fix the price on the z it's 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 been fixed Not too shabby, my people, right off the pegs, bro. I am telling you what, dude. Okay, pretty cool, my people. Pavement to the feet, and it paid off. Peg hunting got us four accords. We didn't have to crack even one case. Unbelievable. Shout out to the Walfarts, dude. They've been getting a lot of this wave. I'm hearing from other collectors as well that they just don't stop dropping. We saw that also happen with the Liberty Walk Skyline wave, at least in this area. And yes, the Nissan Z is back to normal price. All right, pretty cool. Got four more beautiful Accords. These things actually are pretty nice. I mean, I, I like the Liberty Walk Skyline better. You know what my favorite all-time boulevard is. I can't believe we're up to number 88. That is crazy. I showed numbers one through five, the very first wave starting in 2020 in yesterday's video. Okay, I grabbed two more of the Porsche 935s as well, but clearly there was quite a few there left for other collectors. And of course we have the two Accords there. I would love to see the look on someone's face when they walk up and they and they finger through the pegs and they see the little 96 Honda Accord and they're like, yes, two more cars for my collection. And since we're talking about collections, I'm gonna show you something very cool. One of my all time favorite chases to find are Auto World Ultra Reds. I love finding white lightnings. They're they're much harder to find for some reason than the the ultra reds, at least in my experience. We do have two of the beautiful white lightning Dodge Charger Daytona 1969. Daytona Hobby Lobby uh, hooked us up with the one. We got very lucky. I did notice, yeah, there's a little scratch there on the car. What a shame. The pearl lightning, white lightning, pearl white lightning paint, whatever they call it, damaged. But it's all good. This is the one that Foxy underscore 86 part two or Foxy 86 underscore part two. You, you'll find him on Instagram. He's the man. In fact, if you want to do trades and stuff, you can absolutely trust him. He's an incredible, incredible guy. Really love the guy, dude. In fact, someday... We're going to have this man at the compound, dude. We're going we're gonna to have Foxy down. Uh, he, he lives in California, so to come from California to Florida, we're going to have to work it out. But I would be happy to have him on my couch and let him spend some time here, uh, do some hunting, uh, check out the collection etc i love you bro so yeah hit them up but yeah there's a little mark on that one too i mean they're not gonna be perfect right like they're 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 toys i mean yes they're collectibles but they're toys also and the companies that are making these it's like whatever dude they just probably line them up in a row after the machine and then one falls or something hits it and whatever happens happens but as we can see they're pretty similar, dude. Like, I don't see any weird wheel error type flat tire or bad cuts on the wheel. Sometimes that can happen where there's a little too much plastic and you get like a bumpy wheel. Oh, oh, hey now, axle down. See, see, that one's bent, dude. The front axle. It's all good. It's all good. Uh, even on this one, we're... S oh, oh, so maybe it's not bent. Okay, so it's just the tire. Oh, yeah, look, that one is off a little bit. All right, I know. I'm super picky. I'm sorry. Love the white Daytona exclusive game token, dude. Holy cow. If I was playing Monopoly, I would totally crack this and, and pull the game token. I, re I really would. I, I Like, I really, I really would. Okay, this is probably one of my favorite finds ever in my 
collection right off the pegs at the Target. I'm I'm going through. Uh, you know, this is when they first were released. This is the very first release of four pack Auto World cars from the Target release one version A, like literally the first release of this and i'm pulling some cars to the side and boom dude it's in a video you could see it i did find this in a video i didn't just find that i found two bro two different targets and i have shown these on the channel before but again we have a lot of new people two different targets two auto world four pack ultra reds release one version a and unfortunately one night, I don't know why, I was messing with them. And it was at the old compound when I had the bigger stands uh, for these lights. They used to be on their own little stands independently. I dropped them and they went flying and just boom, right off the corner, dude. It was awful. Full transparency, I dropped my Auto World four packs. They were in the bag, two of them, and I damaged the card a little bit. And it broke my heart, man. I'm telling you, it broke my heart. But whatever, it's all good. These are for the personal stash. Maybe one day we'll do something with the extra one on the old Whatnot Collectible app. But I'll tell you what, man. This is one of my favorite finds ever. I absolutely love finding Auto World Ultra Reds. Okay, this one we talked about in a video recently. We found this along with the White Lightning Daytona. If you saw the video, you know. Really cool Garbage Pail Kids Greeny Chase, man. I think this is my second Garbage Pail Kid Greeny Chase. The other one is the uh, Alter Ego Fantasy. Up to Series 5, so a newer series of green light collectibles but what a cool chase all right we got boxes on the way they should be here today we just got bubble wrap so watch those noties for whatnot we will be going live soon and having some fun thank you so much for watching today's video my people i really appreciate all of you and i can't wait to see you in the next one